The federal government and the African Development Bank, AFDB, have inaugurated a tax team on youth employment and skills development. The team is a think tank created to convene a private sector roundtable as an engagement platform to identify and finance its priority project for youth empowerment. Speaking at the inauguration in Abuja on Tuesday, the Minister of Labour and Employment, Chris Ingige, who was represented by the Minister of State, Stephen Ochini, expressed optimism that the program would boost Nigeria's economy. In 2016, the African Development Bank adopted the Youth for Job in Africa strategy with a goal of creating 25 million jobs and equipping 15 million youth in Africa with employable skills in 10 years' time. So it means that by 2026, we intend to create 25 million jobs. From 2016 to date, the African Development Bank in Nigeria has invested over 400 million US dollars, both in the public and private sector, to promote job creation in Nigeria. Our youth population is, it grows exponentially. And so the challenge we then have is really to see how we create systems to facilitate entrepreneurship for our youths. Um, that must go hand in hand with also being able to make them employable uh, for, the, uh, for the market, the labor market that's uh, largely driven by, uh, by the private sector. For that reason, therefore, we must begin to look at our education system uh, really ensuring that the relevant skills that the private sector uh, um, mentioned to us or continue to hammer on are the things that we also address in the ongoing um, educational system uh, reform. The partnership with the African Development Bank on skill development of Nigerian youth is the best thing that can happen to the economic life of this country and to the interests of our youth. It is the best direction. But we still have to redirect our curriculum in Nigeria universities towards skill acquisition training. We will, government should now invest more in those programs that, has, that lead towards self-employment so, so that we can, this will also go a long way to reduce the speed of unemployment in Nigeria.